Alrighty, before we start this video, I just want to caveat by saying that I don't, in the end, I don't really care how you spend your money. I don't really care um, how you do it as long as it's not hurting people. However, um, when it comes to children and something that where children are the majority, uh, that's sort of where I have an issue. And again, I don't really have an issue with what's going on <clears throat> in Once Human. So much so to say is, I just think it's I just think it's uh, not great. And I'll go into the reasonings why. But um, the new Lightforge Loot Crate has been released. You got this beautiful car skin. Um, yeah, I won't even deny it. it's a really, really, really good skin. And I would love to get it. Um, unfortunately for most of us, it's going to be out of reach. Um, not that, not that I can't get it right now if I wanted to, but I'd rather not spend $600 on a in-game skin that maybe in a year's time or two years time or three years time, I might not even be playing this game. So, um, yeah, it's 600 fucking dollars. Isn't that crazy? A skin that is 600 fucking dollars. So let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. So first things first, like I said at the beginning, I do not mind really any monetization system as long as it's not pay to win. I don't really care. Um, I love supporting uh, gaming developers. I think uh, gaming is such a beautiful, beautiful art form, um, much more so than a lot of other things. Um, because I, I get to control the art pretty much. I mean, they, they, they make it look pretty, but I get to control what's going on inside. Um, I love supporting the devs to the point that I've spent, I wouldn't say a considerable amount of money, but a, a decent amount of money. Um, but again, here's where the problem comes in. Uh, I'm not stupid enough to spend $600 on a fucking skin. I'm not. Um, again, I... Get, you can get it in $67. I literally talked to someone yesterday that got it in $67. Or you could probably be like me and I'll probably spend $600. It's fucking, it's stupid. It's stupid. Um, there's no way to go about it. Um, I've heard a lot of people argue that, uh, well, you don't need to spend money on the game. It's free. And you want to know what else I say to them? Why do I not want to support the devs? I mean... If you have a game that you truly wholeheartedly enjoy, you want to support the devs. Whether it be a dollar, five, ten, fifty, a hundred, you want to support them. But there becomes a ridiculous, ridiculous, absurd amount of money where you, you just cross the line. Um, I made the video on the Pyro Glide, and what was that, like two to three hundred dollars, which I thought was ridiculous. Um, why do why do developers not want people to support them? I mean, I know basically the majority of the people who who I talk to, they only and I mean only want to buy the straight out skins. And I'm one of them. I'm one of them. Even if even if they made a skin, hold on, let me actually get it. Even if they made a skin 50 fucking dollars like this. This, by the way, would be on the high end. I don't think I'd spend 60, 70, 80 dollars on a skin, but if it's 50 fucking dollars, I think they'd be willing to support the developers. If they made the car skin, if they make the bike skin, 50 dollars. I think, in fact, I think a lot of people would support the developers way more so than being three, four, five, six hundred dollars. And again, I know people are like, well, you don't have to, you don't have to, but that's not the point. That's not the point. If you enjoy a game, if you enjoy a game and you want to support that game, uh, make sure that its life cycle keeps on going, you're going to want to spend money. But again, you don't really have that option when shit is 600 fucking dollars. Like, that's a, that's a car payment in and of itself. And they're doing that literally every fucking month. They want you to spend three, six hundred dollars. Like, that's, that's absurd. That's absurd. I don't think I don't think anyone I don't think anyone in the right mind could justify spending three to six hundred dollars every month 
on a video game. Seriously, I don't think anyone could. On the low end, that's like $4,000. On the high end, it's like $7,000. Not, I mean, look, look, look at, look at, look at America. Look at America. 50% of people don't even have $500 saved up. And you're expecting people to fucking spend that every month? People, people want to support. People want to support Starry Studios. I want to support Starry Studios. I really do. I really do. But, you know, it's... We're at, we're at a point where it's just like... People just don't even want to spend money. And this is, by the way, this is on top of the negative carcinogen thing that I talked about. Where people thought it wasn't illegal. Which is fucking crazy to me how people don't think that's illegal. And I do a 30 second Google search and it quite literally shows that it's illegal from the FTC. Um, people are already in the negative. So, I mean, it just, it just hurts my brain. It just hurts my brain. Um, again, like, people want to support your game, Starry Studios. People really do. But, like, I, I mean, I don't even need to look at the at statistics of how many people have bought the Pyroglide or have bought this car or have bought anything. I already know it's less than 5%. I, I, it's probably less than 1% if we're actually talking about it. Um probably less than one percent who spent three six hundred dollars if you made it a reasonable price people would buy it and i'll and i'll, and I'll give you i'll give you uh, some some story time with toxic based on based on this um i play a lot of video games and as a content creator i get to interact with some amazing people and i know firsthand that a lot of people they have like a hundred fifty dollar budget Per year, not per month, per year on spending on video games. That's per year. You're asking them to spend double their yearly limit. You're asking them to spend... It's it's incredible. And like, that's the thing. It's like, don't get me wrong. You have the ability. You have the ability to buy these skins. But let me ask you something. Would you rather have a bear skin? Or a motorcycle that's on fire. I mean, I think that's a pretty clear and obvious choice that you want a motorcycle on fire. That sounds sick as fuck. But again, why would people want to spend three hundred dollars? Why would anyone want to spend six hundred dollars? I mean, I feel like I feel like I'm going on a loop right now, but you know, I I think it really needs to be said. I think it really needs to be said. Um, like I don't I don't want to insult starry studios and I, I mean i don't even really think that this would be an insult but i genuinely question how in touch they are with like the financial situations of people like i understand that they're a mobile game i are a mobile development teams trying to get into the like the pc and whatever you call it market i'm i'm aware of that but the mobile market is very different than the PC market. The mobile market is very, very different than the PC market. Like, let's take Clash of Clans. Like, obviously, the majority of people aren't spending money on Clash of Clans. It's only a fair few, but, like, the most expensive stuff. Like, you have anywhere from, like, a dollar to, like, a hundred dollars worth of stuff. Um, if you made something reasonable on PC, a lot of people would buy it. I mean, take take like world of tanks or war thunder or, or literally any of those games or or i mean even call of duty even call of duty call of duty their most expensive stuff is like 30 40 bucks and that's for like crazy crazy skins and a lot of people fucking buy it i mean they're a fucking multi-billion dollar company they're a multi-billion dollar company i just like I did, I did the math on stream, and again, like, I don't really care to go about it, but if they made, let's, let's go back, if they made, uh, let's see if I can find it, where are the guys, where's the thing, so, you have this skin, if you made this 50 bucks, 
you made this 40 bucks. And I guess they're the same. So you make each of them, or I don't know if they're just skins or whatever, or like colors or whatever, but make that 40 bucks. Then you make, I don't know, make the gun like 20 bucks or whatever. Like, people would buy them in mass. People would buy them in mass, and all it would take is what was it? If you make it 300, I think if I, I think I did the math on the Pyro Glide being 40 bucks, but if you make it 50 dollars, it's whatever. But if you make if five percent of the population buys it uh, at 300 dollars, and you compare that to 50 percent, which I think is a very reasonable, I think more than 50 percent would buy the skins if they were reasonably priced. Um, but if you did that and compared to 50% of the population doing $60 or whatever, compared to 5% doing $300, you would double if not triple your fucking profits. So, again, if it's a matter of money, then that answers that. If it's a matter of supporting the devs, well, I want to support them. Like, there's no way you, like, I guess the moral of the fucking discussion is... There's no way you could slice this that justifies it being six hundred fucking dollars. Besides, actually, I, I take that back. Besides making it a rare collectible, but who the fuck cares if it's a rare collectible when you want to make sales? Like, there's nothing really like that. They like that's the, that's the reason why I sort of stray away from that um, idea is because like there's nothing really rare in this game. I mean, maybe besides the metal shells, but more and more people get that by the day. So it's like. Who the heck cares but like the moral of the story is there's no way you can slice this to justify oh making more money or oh like it, there's just no way to, 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 to justify it like i love to hear justification in the in the in the comments as to why it like they should like they should be doing it at 600 not like not like oh they can't do it like of course they can do it but like it, I, it, in my head, it's just not smart. It's just not a smart idea. Um, but again, yeah, just let me know in the comments if, what you guys think. If you guys agree with me, um, if you guys don't agree with me, I mean, again, I try to talk these out so that there's no wiggle room for for um, people who disagree. But you know, people somehow manage to find a way to disagree. So um, again, I reply to all comments. So. Uh, People, for those who disagree with me, let me know why. I'll try to figure out a way to show you or tell you why I disagree. But anywho, but for people who do agree, uh, let me know in the comments. And let me know if you guys would like to buy these skins for cheaper and just outright. Because, I mean, I know they're missing out on a lot of money that they could potentially be getting. And I know you guys want to support the game. So <laughs> that's basically the same way for me. But anywho. I feel like I feel like I've said everything I said I could have said, but um, yeah, there's a lot of going back in circles. But you know, I think I, I think it really needs to be said because it's just it's just like why, it's just like why. But again, let me know what you guys think in the comments. And as always, take care, and I'll talk to you guys later.